For a missing woman in Chafee County takes a new turn. Today, investigators could be seen searching for evidence at a construction site. Thanks for joining us this evening. I'm Kelly Worth. I'm Jim Benham, and you're watching CBS 4 News at 10, also streaming on CBS and Denver. 49 year old Suzanne Morphew went missing on Mother's Day. Her husband says she went for a bike ride and never came home. Well, now the search is focused on an area along the Arkansas River, 12 miles from the family home. Our Rick Salinger on that. That story in Chafee County tonight. Rick, a very focused search today, but investigators have not found her. Not yet, Jim, but tonight I spoke with the owner of this property that is being searched, and he confirmed there is a connection between the missing woman's husband and the land that is now the focus of this investigation. Investigators dug and sifted their way through concrete and dirt. The owners of this property were improving their riverfront land along the Arkansas. Barry Morphew had been hired to lay the dirt. He has been pleading for his wife's return. We'll do whatever it takes to bring you back. We love you, we miss you, your girls need you. An FBI evidence response team spent the day searching for the missing woman. The Sheriff's Department said, despite rumors, no body has been found, no arrests made. 49-year-old Suzanne Morphew was reported missing from a Mother's Day bike ride. Super sad. I mean, it's terrible. It's a small community, you know. Um, they, uh, you know, she, she ate at our restaurant all the time. And The search lasted the entire day. Authorities were tight-lipped. I'm Rick Salinger from Channel 4. Okay. Can you fill me in? No, sir. Can't. The large Morphew home outside Maysville remained sealed off. Previous searches near there of a reservoir and trailer park have failed to turn up the missing woman, a disappearance that has shaken this community. A human being standpoint where, you know, you feel first and foremost for the family. The search will go on. The property owner has told other people that among the devices being used in this search is something like an x-ray machine that is able to see beneath the surface. So far, nothing, but it will continue tomorrow. Live near Salida, Rick Salinger covering Colorado First. Thank you, Rick. Now to the